Alright. I th we need to go uh, take a look in the Harbor Master's office. Gotta get those, uh, the uh, candles. Hopefully, this won't be too hard. Uh, oh, who's this? Benzant. I hear you have Nethers' candle shipment. Yes. Customs duties apply to all imports containing essential oils, caffeine, alcohol, chocolate, licorice, books, human hair, spectacles, clothing, building materials, fabric, grain, anything yellow, clocks, cutlery. Or put it another way, whatever the hell I fancy. That smuggler has to pay customs duty if he wants the smelly candles. Hmm. I I feel like that's a bit that that's a bit of overreach, if I may state my opinion. How much for the candles? Six gold dalders. What? That'd buy a year's supply. How terribly unfortunate. Hmm. See ya. Okay, Shaw, I haven't seen you here before. What's with you? Hello? Multiplied by the denominator, carry the one. Hello? Ah, you made me lose it. Don't bother Scurvy Shaw. He's the deadliest pirate accountant on these isles. Cool. It would be irresponsible not to steal them. <laughs> nice going, Nelly. Three gold dolders. Only three. Hello again. For a value not exceeding two hundred rubles. Hello. Ah, lost it again. Leave him alone. This is a surprisingly simple solution. I'm a bit taken aback. What did you need? Six? Six gold dolders. Boom. Here's your money. Now hand over the candles before I throw in a free shin kick. Business is business. Take the stinking things. I'd better give this package to Nethers. I'm almost disappointed. I expected that to be harder. I expected to have more hoops to jump through. <laughs> or, you know, I expected at the very least for the uh, solution to not be in the very same room. But hey, I'm not complaining. Less hoops to jump through is always a good thing. I think. Alright. Nice. All right, Nethers. I got your writing candles. Oh, you're a belter, Nelly. Do you mind if I keep one of them for personal use? Which scent would you like? I need... We determined we need... Dandelion Dew, Funk, Berry Drizzle, Summer Smog, Goat Aura, Cinnamon Frog. Um. I don't think we want any of these, actually. Goat Aura, please. No problem. Alright, let's look at this chart. Okay, so. How does this work? It 
It's the dial representing the different I Ching scents. It's the dial representing the different I Ching scents. Okay, so these are the scents. How does this work? I guess those are the I Ching scents. One of the effects of the I Ching candles. Uh, do you want Jasmine Mist? Is that what we need? For generosity? Ahoy! I've changed my mind. Can I swap candles? Oh, of course. Jasmine Mist, please. You got it. Okay. Let's uh, look at it. This candle is Jasmine Mist scent. Thanks, Nelly. Alright, hopefully this is the right one. If I understand the puzzle correctly, it should be, I would think. But who knows, it may not be. Alright, let's see how this works out. There we go. Welcome to Fat's Junk Food, established Wednesday the 10th, June 73. Um... That's a very nice copper gong. Ah yes, cast in the Sichuan style during the 4th dynasty. I believe a similar piece sold at Christie's on January the 12th at 3.45. <laughs> Did they write unique dialogue for every candle? Hello. I remember you. Welcome back. <laughs> this is like the... <laughs> memory candle. Well, thank you for a very memorable encounter. <laughs> this is a startled muskrat scent candle. Apparently, this is a startled muskrat scent candle. Apparently, it soothes and calms the chef. Okay. Um. Bye. See you again. We need to figure out... So, generosity is what we want. Could be the one at the top? It's a dial representing the different I Ching scents. Oh, uh, peace and calm. So we need to figure out which one of these, I believe the animals are the astrological signs. Yes? Dandelion, funk, drizzle, smog, aura, cinnamon, fog, vapor, alice, and sw I don't see muskrats though. Weird. I guess those are the I Ching scents. There we go. Huh. Where can I get other I Ching candles? Well, I normally get them from the Nethers. A s yes, but he hasn't made his latest delivery. I wonder if something went wrong. Aren't you? S 
I sense that something went wrong. Bye. See you again. Welcome to Fat's Junk Food. I'm leaving. Okay, wait. Alright, that means this might be another way to solve it. So, better memory. He got the better memory effect. From Jasmine Mist. Which means he's a penguin. Therefore, when we get the effect around to generosity, what's on the penguin? Cinnamon fog. Therefore, we need the cinnamon fog candle to get generosity. I hope. Hopefully I read it correctly this time. I can see a model ship through the window. Oh really? Cool. I'd better not. Alright, let's get a different channel. We needed cinnamon, right? No no no, no I didn't I didn't want to leave. I wanted to talk to Ahoy! Gusty Nethers. I've changed my mind. Can I swap candles? Oh, of course. I need cinnamon fog. Cinnamon fog, please. No problem. <sighs> please work. Please work. I think this should work. To the restaurants. Okay. Let's try this one. There we go. Let's talk. A thousand welcomes to Fat's Junk Food. What do you recommend? You simply must try the gym sum. Here. Delicious. How much is it? Oh, it's on the house, my dear. My customer smiles are the only reward I seek. Okay, uh, this is, uh... Alright, generosity. About that nice copper gong. Oh, yes, yeah. Purely ornamental, but a pleasant piece. Would you maybe give it to me? Of course. Really? Certainly. I'm sure a young woman of your taste will find a better home for it. How generous of you. Thanks. Hello. Please, take a seat, dear customer. Take as many as you like. My seats are at your disposal. Uh, <laughs> I'm leaving. I love this guy. A safe journey. This gong is just what Rackham needs for the bird detector. So, do I have everything I need for a bird detector now? I need... Uh, the large copper dish, an antenna, and I also need a ship to mount it on, right. Well, that's gonna be the tough part. But I've got a gong now. And this candle. It's calming. Anyone need to be calmed? I don't know. Maybe. I'd better not. Fine, Nelly. Be boring. Alright, so let's look at the tea shop. Let's take a real close look at the drinks and see if there's anything that might be useful. 
I'm interested in one of your drinks. Cinnamon cappuccino, slim line coca shot, sober Joe, hemp tea, minty double Italiano sea salt frappe. Uh, I'm thinking. I don't really think I need any of these. Never mind. See ya. None Whatever. of none of them really strike me as beverages that would really help me out with anything. Okay. Alright, so next step is we definitely need to get into, uh, we need to talk, get an audience with Justice Groot. I'm not quite sure how to accomplish that, though. I don't think they work together. She's either an uptight secretary or an uptight school mom. I am an uptight PA, thank you very much. Hmm. No, that's not right. So can we talk to her at all? Uh, excuse me. Who's the chump in the painting? That chump is his eminence, Justice Groot. Pretty jumpy. He is not a chump. Tell me more about chump face. Don't call him that. This is a painting of our distinguished Justice Groat. Justice Groat comes from a long line of Justice Groats. Hmm. Looks like the only person with an appointment today is Mary Jane Picture Morgan. here with his beloved pocket watch, which was sadly stolen. Uh, excuse me. I'm here for my appointment with Justice Groat. I told you. Yeah, but I accidentally said the wrong name. My real name is... Mary Jane Morgan. Better check your list. Huh, <sighs> but I... Oh, it seems you are on the list. Step this way, Miss Morgan. Call me Nelly. That was simple enough. Ah, uh, the Honorable Justice Groot. Yes? Greetings, Justice Groot. I am Nelly Kutelot, adventurer, bird detective, carrier of many objects. And I am Justice Groot. Very busy. Get to the point. Do you remember Captain Lear? Eh? What? Captain Lear, of the Sanitania. You were supposed to sponsor his voyage to Grockle Island. I can't be expected to remember. Um, Enid is in charge of the records. Perhaps she can help you. Okay, uh... Please make me a privateer. A privateer? How irregular. Van Zant keeps a small number of privateers on staff. A noble band, selflessly dedicated to protecting these isles. Make me a privateer, and I'll be twice as noble as those dolts. Uh, perhaps I should consult Van Zandt? Don't consult Van Zandt. An applicant of my noble nobility must address Justice Groat himself. Well, if I was to commission you, you'd have to prove yourself. Yes. How? Hmm. You'd have to show your tactical prowess. Easy. I would require proof of your great deeds. Piffling. And you'd have to be admired by the people. Nee bother. Oh darn. More stuff. Okay. Tactical prowess, prove great deeds, and convince I'm loved by the people. How can I show my tactical prowess? You must play Van Zandt at the great game of the sea. And if I win, you'll believe I have tactical prowess? 
<laughs> My dear, you have no hope of winning against a master like Van Sant. If you can draw against him, then I will be satisfied. Okay. How can I prove my great deeds? A worthy candidate would appear in the annals of maritime history. The what of maritime history? Books, young lady, books. Show me an account of your heroism in a respectable publication, which I very much doubt you'll be able to do, and I will be satisfied on this point. Okay. How can I convince you I'm loved by the people? Well now, let me see. Most popular heroes have a song written about them. Yes. Show me that you've been immortalized in folk song. Then I would consider you a potential candidate. Got it. Catch you later. Oh my goodness, we just got so many more things we need to do.